good morning. Happy you guys are seeing us on Thursday. Today's Wednesday, January 6th. Um, okay, today we're doing just a normal good old style vlog. Cause mom is going to Marshall's, okay? And I need to like try and find some like tops. I was gonna go to Target, but I just went to Target a couple days ago. Wasn't really like feeling any of the things that they were having out as far as like decor. And I don't know, I haven't, I haven't been to Marshall's and my Marshall's and my home goods are connected, so perfect. Oh goodness, okay, the kids are fighting already. So. Um, first things first, I'm gonna be stopping. This is like my routine. I'm trying to show you a day in the life like with my routine and the only thing I missed was We are dressed and I am showered and now Kai is yelling at me Per usual we are starting our morning with mass chaos um, okay, so story time. I had a really weird dream last night. I did not sleep like at all because Kai didn't go to bed till two in the morning and then woke up at four in the morning. So we slept until 9 a.m. this morning because whew, that was tough. And Riker's been breaking out of his crib and he wasn't even the worst part last night. It was his five year old fully sleep trained sister. Yeah, so, he was, anyway. He was sleeping. He was sleeping in my bed. No, he was sleeping in his crib last night. We are um, upgrading Riker to a big boy bed soon with guardrails on there. Um, I talked a little bit about it over on Instagram, but he can break out of the crib, which um, has a crib tent on there. And for those of you who don't have toddlers or um, have not seen that before, because I saw somebody like dogging on a mom with a crib tent the other day. Right, or Kai, Kai no. Get Put, you have to put him on the leash, honey. He runs away. Okay. Um, anyway, so Riker has a crib tent. Basically, it prevents them from climbing and falling out of their crib. That's what a crib tent is for. It's like a mesh thing that goes over the top. Um, but Riker can break out of it and do it with a sleep sack on backwards so that he can't unzip it. Come on, Koda. Come. All right. So it's me. Don't do it like that. <laughs> it's like mass chaos. Okay, so it is 34 degrees outside, by the way, today. And I live in Minnesota, and I promise you that it's not a normal thing for January. Usually it is negative 34 degrees with wind chill. Um, so I'm actually, man, I'm gonna get a lot of heat for this. I'm warm in this jacket I'm wearing. I am like so used to the cold and 34 to 40 degrees like don't get me wrong is cold but it's not as cold as negative 34 trust me on this one okay I need to charge my watch but back to that story I was telling you guys about okay so in a nutshell is really weird I haven't like I haven't watched any YouTube channels in a, in a while because I just I don't I don't have time I follow everybody on Instagram so I like will scroll through their pictures so I wonder if I like subconsciously like saw one of Karen's pictures my brain was like oh let's have a dream about them and I had a dream that I was friends with them and it was really weird and like I lived in Florida and it was so real and like when I woke up this morning I was like I, that's what it felt like. It was like coming out of a different reality. It was really weird. So, anyway, that was kind of a boring story time, but that's what it was. I oh, and Karen and I had like put on this like multi, multi, like million dollar event. Okay, so just get back from home goods. Oh, there's a cereal box on the floor. That's good. Okay, so first off, this rug. You can't really tell on this side, but if I go over here, there's the cereal box. If I go on this side, you can see like, so this is a thinner jute rug and it's starting to like roll up. So I think I just need like a, I'm gonna, I obviously need rug tape, I know that, but 
Um, I think I need just like a heavier jute and something that's not as light. Um, I want it to be darker like this. Okay, so here's this jute color versus this. This is like a super light tan and this is like a medium tan. This is not dirt, it's just like what's inside of like the, whatever, the jute. Um, so I got this runner on clearance for like $12. It's like, I just threw it on really quick to see if I liked it. Got it on clearance for $12, super cute. Um, and then I also grabbed this plant stand. It came with a basket inside of it that I didn't love, but I loved this plant stand so much that I had to get it. So I put my aloe in there for now, and then I just picked up these dog bowl dishes. They have like the bubbles on them. They're so cute. Uh, I, think it was, I think I got it from Target. Yeah, I got them from Target and they are like they have the bubbles on them so that they match like some of my other stuff So anyway, I'm loving this corner. Let's see if Raker will leave this alone Over here. I got excuse your butt Coda. Oh my gosh. Okay. So case in point I so I got these baskets for my plants And I'm gonna have to okay you two they're always always playing get out of the plant, please sir. Thank you. Okay <laughs> so I've moved these plants and this one looks so sad because Charlie has just destroyed this plant. I moved it downstairs into like the windowsill in the basement um, before Thanksgiving when I was starting to decorate for Christmas because yeah, it just, he destroyed it. So I need to bring her back to life a little bit. I think I'm just gonna have to keep this in the windowsill in the basement and do like a plant window. This fiddly fig, oh my gosh, like all my plants, animals, and my kids just destroy them. Um, this I got for like 25 bucks. Um, it's a live one off of Home Depot, I believe it was Home Depot or Lowe's. And um, Riker likes to tear holes in the leaves, so it's looking a little beat up, but this one is. This one is typically in my room upstairs. She needs a good water and some fertilizer, but I am gonna put her back up in the room. I'm gonna get some fake plants to go in here, um, but I picked up these two baskets from um, Home Goods. I think they're like, this one was $19.99. This one was um, $16.99. They look like two different colored strings, but actually in real life, they're the exact same color. It's just the lighting is making it look weird. Um, anyway, so I'm gonna pick up some fake plants to put in here because my animals cannot control themselves and same with my children, but that's okay. Anyway, these are super cute. I'm loving this like boho style. So just to give you guys like an overview, I'm loving the way that this is coming together. Now, this shelf, I love, like I, I feel like I need to change this map out to something else, like a really cute like um, like maybe like a rattan mirror would be really good. Um, anyway, I don't know. These shelves I'm not super in love with, but all of it together comes together. Like all of it together looks really nice, but there was a like Moroccan like etched wood um, thing at like a buffet at Home Goods a couple weeks ago. It's not there anymore. But I loved it, and that's actually what I was going to pick up today at Home Goods because I loved it, but it's gone. So, but I was gonna put that there and then do like a huge mirror, but I don't know what to do th with this space. I'm just gonna leave it for now and just keep adding like things that I like. I wanna do some more like terracotta pieces in here for the spring, like the like original terracotta like color, and then do some more like white like pottery on here and just kind of like mix it up and make it a little bit more boho farmhouse because that's just like what my heart gravitates towards. Also, this um, this vase Riker keeps picking up. This is like, I just moved everything around so it looks kind of awkward. I moved, this plant was over here and I moved that over here and put the aloe in there. So anyway, and this is all my office stuff. These baskets hold like my notebooks, my planners, and my laptop because this is where I like sit and edit and I've got messy cushions which is why I'm starting to pile them up because I need to run them through the washer. Oh, and the, um, a truck. Thank you, Riker. Aesthetic. Okay, so right now it's five o'clock. I have some chicken thighs 
defrosting in the microwave, which is not ideal. I know it's not ideal, but um, I didn't have anything defrosted ahead of time. So we're just gonna let that defrost in the microwave and I am going to pack Riker up. Should go bye bye, should go get Kaya. This little monster, look at him. Come on, all the things on the stairs. Outfits, this kid, I tell you what, he, oh my gosh. I put a bib on him and he still managed to get cottage cheese all over himself, so I had to change him and then he had a blowout, so I had to change pants and all the things today, buddy, huh? Huh? So anyway, my house is a mess, per usual. But that's okay, that's okay. I totally forgot to end the vlog yesterday. Um, things got absolutely crazy. Bedtime was not going well. <laughs> um, like I have mentioned before, Riker has been like breaking out of his crib and he's going through what I'm assuming is a sleep regression because um, he is just about two. Um, he'll be two next month. So anyway, um, all right. Um, yeah, like I said, everything just went crazy yesterday and basically watched history in, in the making. Um, yesterday was just crazy. So I did not pick up the camera for the rest of the day. I, who like mentally this morning, I just had to, um, I had to get out of the house after I dropped off Kaya at preschool, I ran to Target just to like get some steps in, just wander around Target. And anyways, I'm gonna show you guys what I ended up picking up from Target because I found some pretty cute stuff. So um, like I showed you guys yesterday, I got like baskets from Home Goods, um, and at Target today, so I'm kind of getting ready for spring here, but um, and I might move this to the top shelf because I'm afraid that somebody's gonna pull on this. But um, 
I got this cute, like, I got this artificial plant from Target. I love how it, like, drapes down. And I love that it's fake because then my cat um, can't destroy it and I can't kill it. So, anyway, I am going for, I love, like, doing lots of greens in the spring and summertime. And I think that this just, like, matches the aesthetic really nicely. And it looks a little crazy right now, like, with the, um faux like Christmas tree still up um, and the wreaths but um, this is where I plan on putting it and just kind of having like that plant aesthetic here in the corner and again here's this corner so cute so I just plan on having like lots of plants on here my white bowls for the aesthetic um but yeah I'm loving how everything's coming together I have like a mixture of now like some fake succulents and now like the real um plants as well. All right, let me show you what else I got from Target. Um, I grabbed Riker another blanket, which is why I've got garbage here. I can't find his favorite blanket anywhere, so I picked up another one. He's sleeping with it right now. Thank goodness he's actually taking a nap. Um, I saw these magnetic letters in the dollar spot. It was like $3 for these, um, and I'm gonna work on letters with Kaya and with Riker. Um, now, some like keto things. I grabbed some fresh jalapenos. Um, I love to munch on these. And then I'm out of green peppers and I didn't feel like going to Sam's Club this week. So hi, did you break out of your crib? Um, so anyway, I got some green peppers. Hang on, I'm gonna go put him back down. Okay, I'm really hoping that he stays in there, but I know he's gonna break out again. He only slept for like 20 minutes in the car, so. Oh, um, okay, so anyway, these are some of my most favorite um, drinks. It has the sparkling ice. Um, there is a zero sugar, zero carbs, five calories per can, and it has caffeine in it. I always grab these when I go to Target. Um, this is my favorite flavor, but I also like the blue raspberry. Um, and then I grab myself a pair of leggings from Target. Um, these are some of my favorites. And then I grabbed um, Riker a pair of sweatpants and a shirt. I try to grab him an outfit every time I go to Target just to build his wardrobe. So I grabbed this cute little outfit for him. This is a um, Johnny Cash shirt. I got it in a 3T so that it was like a little bit bigger on him. Um, and then I also picked and then I also picked up um, just like a plain gray shirt. Oh yeah, he broke out of his crib again. Um, and I picked up a baking mat. I've been meaning to get a silicone baking mat for a while. So I grabbed um, one of these. I think it was like $8. Um, and then I also grabbed like this three-tiered like um, storage bin. Hi buddy, did you break out? <laughs> Yeah, um, I grabbed this three-tiered storage bin so that I could um, have somewhere to put like the toys and books that are in their room right now because I'm gonna have to take the rest of them out um, for sleep training so that basically the bedroom is only for sleep for right now. Um, and speaking of sleep training, okay, so I grabbed um, Pillow Fort, just so you guys know this week is 40% off. So if you need to get your kids some bedding, head over there or go online. Um, I got like all of the stuff. It was like 70 bucks worth for um, like 40 bucks. It was such a good deal. Um, so I grabbed, Kaya has a light pink one, a light pink, a light pink blanket like this. Um, so I grabbed Riker a gray one. Excuse me, animals. Oh, for goodness, okay. Um, and then Kaya has mermaid sheets and I wanted to kind of follow like the same theme and have it kind of match So I grabbed Riker this like nautical set has like whales. It's like the treasure island or the um, Castaway Cove is the one that it's called and it's just kind of nautical um, And has like super cute prints on it. It is a navy. It looks kind of black on camera, but it is navy um, and then this is boring, but um, I got Mike some deodorant. Mike likes the natural deodorants. Um, I saw good ratings on this. It's probably not gonna be his favorite. He really likes the native stuff, but it's like $12.99 per like thing. It's so crazy expensive. Um, and then oat milk. This is the oat milk that we use. And then um, 
I have really been liking this um, light margarita mix lately. It has, um, let's see, it has 10 calories and two grams of carbs. And I, um, I love this stuff just for like when mommy needs a little drink on the weekends, it's super good. So anyway, that is what I got from Target and Riker is totally destroying everything. Whew. Okay, I am going to end the vlog there for today. Also, this is Riker's Blanky, um, the one that's missing. This is the brand new one. Um, I'm really glad that Target still had them in stock because he is obsessed with his Blanky and was like so excited when I picked up a new one. Um, anyway, oh, okay, thank you, Coda. <laughs> I'm going to end the vlog there for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Lots of like shop with me. Um, I just... I've been doing some retail therapy this week, I guess. Um, and I now need to clean the entire house because it is a mess again. So, all right guys, I will see you in a couple days for a clean with me and organize with me. I'm gonna be um, sharing like the toy organization and like taking all of the toys out of the kids' room and putting them um, into these bins and then um, setting up Riker's big boy bed. So, all right guys, I will see you in a couple days for that video, okay? Bye guys.